complete combination of the mind, association of the mind. So many things in the mind, it becomes very difficult to realize anything at all. Mind has to be intellectually satisfied, emotionally satisfied. There are no jewelry tricks, brother. You have to work hard and then depend upon his grace. But the mind is direction is outside into the world. So both things are there. Mind is pulling outward, soul is pulling upward. But is there anything at my level of consciousness now that I can recognize as being full within myself? No. Because we are so much dominated by the mind. Soul is absolutely under the sway of the mind. So you can not recognize your soul at all. When you go beyond the realm of mind and maya, mind is no more. When you go beyond the realm of mind and maya, mind is no more. Christ said, knock and it shall be open. Master said, the door is locked on the inside and Maharaji has the key. Rabia said, why do you knock on an open door? Come on through. Tulsi Sahib said, why are you so shy? Cast away thy veil, that the one sitting behind the veil may behold thee. Please let us go to the door. If it is open, we will walk in, otherwise we will knock it. Let us first find the door. Self-analysis and self-pity doesn't lead us anywhere at all. The time we give to meditation is a sacrifice. Our duty is to knock for him to open. We can't take on our shoulders his responsibility to open also. That is for him to open. We have to beg. It is for the householder to give. But is there anything at my level of consciousness now that I can recognize as being full within myself? No. Because we are so much dominated by the mind. Soul is absolutely under the sway of the mind. So you can not recognize your soul at all. When you go beyond the realm of mind and maya, mind is no more. When you go beyond the realm of mind and maya, mind is no more. So you are mind. Mind is going to recognize the soul at a certain level of consciousness. A certain level of consciousness. A certain level of consciousness.